everyone, my name is Tori, and today's video is going to be my Mickey mini ear collection. And I'm just going to go through all of the mini ears that I have. Um, I have six pairs. I have gotten them from Disneyland, Disney World, and I think one from Etsy as a gift. So these are all pairs, these are all ears that I purchased in the parks, and they all kind of have a little story, a little meaning behind them. So I'm going to do my best to explain that part of it as I go through it as well. So um, this first pair is currently on my head. Uh, I'll give you a little close up. So the first pair that I have are silver sequins. Um, bought these at the parks. Can't remember if it was Disneyland or Disney World. Probably Disneyland. Um, I love this pair of ears. I feel like it goes with the most. Goes with the most. <laughs> like I can wear it with the most things. Um, it matches more of my outfits, that sort of thing. So this is always a staple pair that I take with me anytime that we go to the parks, whether it's world or land. Um, so that way I can match it to whatever shirt or outfit that I have. Um, so this is probably... I would say it's one of my favorite pairs because it goes with so many things and I can wear it with so much. And it's just so classic. The next pair that I kind of feel the same way about, uh, this is the, well, it's the new rose gold ears. It has the metallic bow and the sequin ears in the classic headband style. I love these ears. I just think they're so pretty and just like the silver ones, that I love the ears with the sequins because they just think Oh, they shimmer in the sun and it's just like pixie dust. I love it. Um, these ears I love because I feel like they go with so much. Um, I can wear them with pretty much any outfit. I love rose gold. It's my favorite metal to wear and like jewelry wise. Um, so I love to wear these ears. Um, the only thing that I don't like about these ears is I feel like, well I kind of feel like this about most of the ears, but especially the rose gold ones. They're really tight on my head. Um, so they don't fit me or they fit me really tight and they tend to give me a headache. But um, other than that, I love these ears. And these are one of my favorites and my newest pair. Next up, I have a classic. This is just the classic furry, <laughs> furry, they're fuzzy mini ears um, with the red and white bow. So these ears are fuzzy to the touch. They're not velvet. I know I don't know what kind of fabric this is, but it feels like if you were to get like a stuffed animal, it feels like that type of fur and it carries down onto the headband and the bow feels like satin. Um, I love these ears because they're just the classic mini ear. Um, I do think they look a little silly on me just because I think that the bow is so big and chunky, but um, <laughs> they're cute though. Um, I bought these in Disneyland when I was there. Did I? And I know I would say I would tell you where I got these specifically in the story, and I can't remember if I bought these at Disney World or Disneyland. I can't remember. Um, but I bought them at one of those places. So I definitely got this pair in the parks. Um, I love these ears, and I just I think they're just so classic looking. Next, I know exactly where I got these ears. These ears are from Disneyland, and I bought these at the parks at Disneyland in the Magic Kingdom. Uh, for the, I think it's Disneyland 25, like the diamond celebration. Um, it was, they were celebrating 25 years at Disney that year and we were in the parks and I bought this at the, um, at Magic Kingdom. And these are the special, I don't know if they're limited edition, so I don't know if you can get these anymore, but, um, this is a little foam bow. The only thing I don't like is I wish it had some embellishment on the back like it does on the front, but it's foam. Um, and it's got jewels on the top and there's glitter in between. Um, and then the sequins along the headband and on the ears are, um, like a holographic black. So very, very pretty in the sun. Um, not exactly my favorite to wear only because I think that I just I just feel like the ears are really far apart and the bow is an odd shape. I just think that they could have maybe made this a little bit cuter for the diamond celebration. Um, but I still think they're cute and I'll still wear them and I still wore them. I just don't think that they look the best on me personally. Um, but I am really happy to have these. So this is definitely a great memory for me um, with these ears. So <laughs> Next up I have another classic pair of ears and this is the solid sequin mini ears. So it's got the red sequin bow and then the black sequin ears and it carries down the side of the headband as well. This is so pretty to wear in the sun. Oh, I love these ears. Um, these are one of my favorite pairs to wear as well. I kind of feel like the same way about the silver and the rose gold since it is such a classic color combination. There's so many different ways that you can wear this and I feel like it's um, 
it matches, you know, because it's an appropriate classic look. Um, I love these ears. I just think they're so flattering, like the um, the size of the bow and all of that. But um, I actually bought these in Disneyland when I was there with my best friend. And um, yeah, so that has a good memory associated to it. And all of our pictures we were in together, she was wearing this pair. Um, not this exactly one, but she was wearing these and I was wearing these. And um, it's just really cute. So I love having that memory associated with these ears. And um, when I travel, I'll usually take the, this pair as well. This is one of my staple pair. The next pair that I have, I had a complete fit over and just had to have the second I saw them. And these are the Halloween ears. And I bought these at, I believe, Disney World 2016. I might be making that up. I think that's right. Um, I'm pretty sure I bought them. I bought them at an off time. It's like I was there in... Um, I see. I can't remember. It doesn't make sense to me. I bought them like when they'd been released, but it was before Halloween. So I found them somehow when they had just been released. I really don't know. I don't, I wish I remembered, like I need to write these things down, but this was the Halloween ears that they released however many years ago. It was a few years ago. Um, I love the orange sequin bow with the polka dots and the satin ears. Um, and it has the same pattern on the back. And I just think these are so cute and so perfect for Halloween. Um, I actually don't think I've ever worn these in the parks because I got them in like not Halloween time season. Um, so I really want to go back like in October, you know, September, or October and go to Mickey's not so scary Halloween parties. I've never been before. And I would love to go to that party and wear these ears. That would be like, that's the dream, but I love anything Halloween. So I love these ears for that reason. Next pair I have are another seasonal pair and these are the Christmas ears, the holiday time ears that I bought. Um, November of 2017. So uh, my boyfriend and I went to Disney World in November. Is that right? When did we go? We went this year, March. This actually might have been November 2016. Oh my gosh. I think I bought these November 2016. Um, when we were there for Thanksgiving, they already had all of the Christmas and holiday things out. Um, I saw these and of course had to have them. They're red and green. Um, I wore them while I was there and I wore them with like a Peter Pan outfit. I had a like a green Peter Pan shirt um, and like a red and green flannel. So I looked very Christmassy for Thanksgiving. But um, I love these ears. They're just so pretty. And they've got this the sequin carried all the way around and down the side of the headband. And it has this little satin holly here with the beads, which I think is a really cute detail. So I love these ears and I really want to go back during um, Christmas time, December, so I can wear these again. My last pair here I was given as a gift from one of my best friends. And this is a Peter Pan themed set of ears from Etsy. So it has um, like felt down the headband and it's felted on the back on the ears. And then she has the can't get it to focus. And then it's got the little red feather, um, the leather wrap and the satin bow and the, um, these little bows on the ears and bows, flowers on the ears. I think these are just so cute and, um, they're so well made. Uh, just so well made. I'll link this Etsy shop down below. She has so many really, really cute pairs of ears there. Um, I would really love to, you know, own them all, right? But I would really love to get another pair. What I love about these ears, um, something that I'm kind of learning too, is the Disney World, Disneyland, like park ears are a little tight. I think they're made smaller probably so that way kids can wear them too, right? So, um, but Etsy ears, you can, or in my experience with this headband, it's so much, it's just looser and it's so much more comfortable to wear. So, um, for that reason, I love these ears even more, but, um, also the sentimental value that my best friend sent them to me for my birthday. So I love wearing these in the parks and, um, with my Tinkerbell and Peter Pan outfits. Well, that's all I have for today's video. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you next time.